Okay, today is November 28th and I'm doing a test because we had a cold night tonight. Didn't get down to freezing, but I wanted to do a test because I've got a couple of these uh, smudge pots and this is the first time I've used them before and I wanted to see how they work compared to burn barrels. Um, they definitely have their pros and cons. The burn barrel definitely puts out more heat. I can see that after doing this test tonight, but um, a lot less work involved using one of these things. So we'll see how I end up using it in the future, but I'll come over here and show you over here by this avocado tree where I've got a temperature thing hanging so we can see what the temperature. Oh, there we go. 34.9 I've seen it as low as 34.5 but basically 35 degrees and that was what that's what they called for tonight you can see I put this is another thing I tried this year that I didn't do last year mango this mango tree is probably a little over 12 foot tall and I've got a 20 by 20 tarp and I'm, what I'm just trying to do is trying to house that enough to catch heat in there to help especially the back side of the tree which last year would get the the freezes would do more damage on the back side of the tree so just trying that out for an experiment I did notice the tarp alone gave about uh, somewhere around two to three degrees advantage even without heat so but I'll show you in here we'll get inside of this tree a little bit and basically 44 degrees right there on the pulse side and then there's one over here Five. 41.5, so 43.5, you know, somewhere in the neighborhood of six to basically, we'll call it six to eight degrees advantage underneath this tree. But it's not as good as I had hoped. You can see the leaves are getting a bit toasty. Much pot works okay. I'm not wish it was worked a little bit better, but as far as the amount of heat it gave, but it would definitely uh, protect this tree probably down to oh somewhere around 25, 26 degrees. It'd probably be okay, just like last year, which is about as typically about as cold as we get here. I might use it. I probably won't use it in this situation in the future in a, in a serious freeze. I'll probably use it maybe for uh, protecting something that only needs a little bit of help. Maybe like the lychee or something like that. But that's uh, the test that we've done tonight. And now I know how it works and compared to a burn barrel. and. Hopefully uh, we won't have to deal with any serious freezes this year, but tonight definitely kind of came close to the freeze range. And we'll, uh, we'll see what happens in the future. So that's it for this video and just wanted to share this test. All right, bye.